So in one of my early morning morning thoughts shows, I showed a video clip of a this particular incident right here where the lady was ambushed in her car. She was in the car with a taxi driver and two bike roll up and the man them jump off of the bike, run down the car, shoot up the car, open the door, shot inside the vehicle and all these other things, right? I showed that on one of those earlier shows. I wasn't too straight on the information but now i am so contract killer pleads guilty to murder details saint andrew double killing so not only did he plead guilty but he also detailed what he and his cronies did so wade blackwood 24 years old has pled guilty to two counts of murder illegal possession of firearm and ammunition in the home circuit court in downtown Kingston today. A man who described for police investigators how Simone Campbell Collymore, the wife of popular businessman Omar Best Collymore, screamed as he and a crony sprayed her in the taxi with bullets. He has pleaded guilty to these counts of murder. <laughs> Let me pause for a second before me read any further. Jesus, peace. Can I imagine the woman final uh, minutes or final seconds? You're screaming at the top of your lungs for your life and a man just a pepper you with gunshot at close range and no mercy. And his only intention is to make sure that you are dead when he leaves the scene. Now, Wade Blackwood, who is 24 years old, he also pleaded guilty to two counts of illegal possession of firearm and ammunition as well. Winston Walter, the owner and operator of the ill-fated taxi, was also shot to death in the February 2nd, 2018 attack at the entrance to Campbell Collimore's Forest Ridge apartment complex on Stanley Terrace in Red Hills. This apartment complex has a gate, a big iron gate, and it was there as the taxi approached the gate and the big iron gate was swinging open slowly. The man them ride up on the taxi and does start shoot, shoot, shoot. A post-mortem revealed that Campbell Collimore was shot 19 times and died from those multiple gunshot wounds to the chest and the abdomen with injuries to the lungs, the liver, and the right kidney. This is what the autopsy report showed. Walters, who was shot five times and died as a result of the gunshot wounds to the head, according to the post-mortem reports that were cited in the court documents. So all the taximan get it to know. Taximan collect five gunshot when it seems like she is who they came for. Anyways, the killing was captured on closed circuit television CCTV. One of the factors that nudged Blackwood to plead guilty, the fact that he was already seen on tape doing it. Video recordings and the quality of still images captured by the CCTV showed Blackwood approaching the front passenger side of the vehicle and firing into it. This is what the court documents revealed, but we already saw that on video as well. If you watch back one of my morning thoughts, then one of the recent ones, you will see the video there. Campbell Collimore's mother and sister fought back tears as they walked out of the courtroom moments before the video was being played in court. Omar Collimore is among four other persons that were charged with his wife's murder. So this was a hit on a wife done by her very own husband. A way your wife could have do you so. At one point she was good enough for you to marry her and thought that you wanted her to be your forever thing. I mean, Jamaica, Jamaica where woman dash out, Jamaica where beautiful woman are plenty, Jamaica where if you are a prominent, well-known and wealthy businessman that you can pretty much have your pick of the litter, Jamaica, a way this woman could have do him so. Make he wanted her dead in this manner. 19 shot enough. And when they went, the taxi driver was just collateral. Dash where life. 
Five months after the killings on June 20th, 2018, Blackwood detailed his involvement in the caution statement recorded by police investigators in the presence of two justices of the peace, fully confessing. He recounted that on January 1st, 2018, two men who he knew told him that they had a mission to go upon and asked if he wanted to come along on the mission. The men's names were withheld. Why? Blackwood said that he declined the offer at first, but indicated that his response did not go too well with the men. She for dead enough, is what he quoted both of them as saying. So we know said this is a murder mission. Blackwood said that later on that day, he got what he suggested was a threatening telephone call from one of the men. Yo, member say your brother, borrow man things, and you know, pay your feet yet. So wait till me come back. A different thing, he quoted one of the man as saying. Borrow man things could mean, say, somebody borrow somebody's gun and hasn't paid back for it yet. And now they are holding a family member accountable and he is going to have to pay. One of the ways of paying is to do a mission like this because somebody paid for this mission to be done. We now know that to be the husband. He told investigators that on the day of the killing, the men came back on two motorcycles. He confessed and said that he got on one of the motorcycles and they drove to the foot of Red Hills where they stopped to purchase gas. He said that one of the men made a phone call then relayed the message to him that the Toyota Axio motor car in which Campbell Collimore was traveling was coming up the road right now. Now, according to Blackwood, they were joined by two other men, also on a motorcycle, and they all drove behind the taxi until it got to the gated apartment complex. One of the men, them, who they, were, who they are holding his name, this is how he described it, that one of the guys who he's not saying his name came off of the bike and started firing shots in the driver's side. And me, me just fire in at the passenger side, he said. Oh my God. He told investigators that he fired into the car and he heard Cal Campbell Collimore, which is the female, scream as the glass windows were shattering around her. He recalled handing back the murder weapon, which is a Glock pistol, to his friend and then burning the clothes that he wear or he was wearing when he committed this murder. People, listen up. Me no know. It does not make sense to me because right now a lot of people are saying, Jano, the death penalty needs to be upheld. And I am one of them that says, I would love for the death penalty to come back, but... It would have to come back after things are fixed up because I don't want to see the wrong people getting executed for stuff they didn't do. However, check this out. When I catch you on CCTV and I see that that is you and then I get a full confession with a description, your neck for Brock. Am I wrong or right? Leave your comments in the comment section below. I don't even want to talk about this one no more because I'm about to just get heated and say a whole bunch of different something. We all have mothers, sisters, grandmothers. Could you imagine this woman's last minutes, man? And then for the people them out there who are in relationships and you swear for your partner. Oh, he loves me so much and she is the best thing smoking. Listen up. Woman love up them husband and then open the door at night time for gunman come in, come kill him, you hear me? Man do the same thing. So, keep your head on a swivel. Can't trust nobody these days. That's just how the world we are living in is. I'll catch you on the next video. It's SoFlo. I'm out. Peace.